Dax, let's talk about hit and run. Uh, you, as you said, you got a lot of people. You also got your uh, your, your lovely lady. Yes, Can I call my... you your lady, Kristen Bell? Oh, yes, yes, yes. The greatest thing that's ever happened to me. Kristen Bell is the leading lady in the movie, and I'm sure you guys all... See, she's going to be on the show here Wednesday. Oh, very good. Right. They so... don't tell me anything. I just... No. <laughs> I just sit here and, oh, you know, oh Sly's on tomorrow. Slice on tomorrow. I'll take care of it. <laughs> okay, 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 good then. We'll just still deflate the minute he sits down. Um, uh, uh, but yeah, she, she's, she's in it, uh, which, you know, we're a real life couple. Yes, you are. So yes, you I don't know, did you, did you feel like our chemistry was, was nice? Did you enjoy it? It felt very forced. It did? Uh, okay, great. <laughs> no, it, it, it's fantastic. You guys are great together. Oh, thank you. And, uh, and, and it would be terrible if a real life couple made a movie to, where they're together in the movie and people yeah. said, we don't buy it. It's that happened. would be terrible. It's, it's definitely happened more times than not, I think. Yeah. It's well, very high risk. I thought you guys uh, did a great job. And uh, I'm curious, there's a scene that really uh, stands out where um, some of the characters burst into a motel room mm -hmm. and there's some elderly uh, swingers. Vacationers. Vacationers. Yeah. And they're... I think they're called lifestylers, actually. <laughs> Not my business, right. not my concern. Mine, mine neither. I do not judge, right. I accept. Uh, but you, you, your characters burst in uh, on these people and they're not clothed. No, they're nude. They're, they're nude very and nude. nothing's left to the imagination in that scene. No. It's quite uh, shocking. Mm -hmm. the, I, I heard a rumor, I don't know if it's true, that the actors were not told what they would be seeing. No, I don't think you could fake the reaction that we got from them seeing these folks for the first time. So you had to get it in one take. You yes, know? well, and one guy in particular was a standout. Very talented, this gentleman. Um, <laughs> the producer, I didn't see him either, but the producer came to the hotel room next to us where we were set up, and I said, how's it looking over there? And he said, well, one of the guys is very, very camera ready <laughs> and very camera friendly. And he was not lying. There's a guy in this movie that is 109 pounds and 30 pounds of it is Wang. As you saw, <laughs> his body mass index is, it's overwhelming. I hope he wins some kind of a award. Like a disproportiony or something. I mean. You think there's an award called the disproportiony? <laughs> yeah, I do, I do, I do, I do. Well, I'm hoping for uh, this guy's sake because he is, he's beautiful in the film. And I actually brought a picture of he and I at the, um, at the premiere together. Oh, this is you guys at the premiere. Yeah. Now, uh, now that, <laughs> Wait, I don't know one, who he's looking at. Which one's him? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, also, who's he looking at? I mean, Maybe he's... not me, not the camera. You know, Bradley Cooper was at the premiere. I think he might be locked, target locked on Cooper or something. <laughs> he, he couldn't commit to that photo with me, but God bless him. We He's have great. a clip here from the film, and uh, very quickly, uh, you uh, are a guy. I don't want to give anything away, okay. but uh, you were on the run from some very bad people. Yes, I, I had to testify against my very best friend, and he ended up in jail for a while, and we haven't seen each other in four years, and we've just now come together, and I found out some terrible news about him, and I tried to find the silver lining in it, and I'm terrible at it. Yeah, and this... Yeah. Uh, so this is your, the guy who's out to kill you, Bradley Cooper. Yes. All right, let's take a look at this uh, scene from Hit and Run. You got off! What are you talking about? I was in jail for eight months. Oh, my oh. God, eight months? I don't understand what you're talking about. I don't understand what no. you didn't like the gym equipment. There wasn't enough time for you to read. I got um, in prison because of you. <laughs> yeah. That's horrible. I did not realize that happened in jail. I thought that was a prison thing. Yeah, well... I guess it's not exclusive to prison. Was it a black guy? No, it wasn't a black guy. Can we just go? Okay. Was it a Mexican guy? Guys, those are Nazis? Because if so, man. Charlie, it doesn't matter who violated him, okay? It could have been any number of people. It doesn't matter their race, okay? Could have been Latino, could have been Tongan, could have been Persian. It was Filipino! 